The process of managing problems and coming up with workarounds for them is called problem management. In the context of ITIL, a problem is the cause of one or more incidents or potential incidents. The cause may not be known at the time of incident's occurrence. Problems are initially classified as incidents and are documented in problem records. A workaround is a temporary way to restore service failures to an operational level. Example, rebooting a server. The reason behind the server's failure may not be known. However, on rebooting, the service can be restored. Workarounds are used for reducing or eliminating the impact of an incident or problem for which a full resolution is not yet available. Workarounds for problems are documented in known error records and workarounds for incidents that do not have associated problem records are documented in the corresponding incident records. Incident or problem records are created in the service management tool. In the next screen, let us discuss known errors and a known error database. Once a problem is identified, based on its priority, effort is directed towards finding the root cause. A temporary fix or a workaround might be used to restore services to a usable level for the time being. The moment a workaround or an unresolved root cause to the problem is found, it becomes a known error and IT services are aware of the issue. Known errors are managed throughout their life cycle with the problem management process. Development teams or suppliers may also identify known errors. For example, application incompatibility reports for Windows by Microsoft. A database is created for known errors, workarounds, and their solutions. This database is called Known Error Database or KEDB. It helps in faster diagnosis and resolution of incidents. In the next screen, we will discuss the priority of an event and how it is calculated. Priority means the relative importance of an incident, problem, or change. It is used to identify required times for action to be taken. For example, the Service Level Agreement, or SLA, may state that priority to incidents must be resolved within 12 hours. Priority is calculated based on the impact and urgency of the issue. Impact is the measure of the effect the issue has on the business processes of IT service support. Urgency is how soon the issue can be handled. Priority equals impact plus urgency. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.